Hello, welcome to this video. It's Leonard here from DigitalLearner.com and in today's video tutorial, I am going to tell you the truth about the Royal Q board. What I have personally experienced based on my own personal experience, I'm going to tell you because why I'm actually making this video is because of the comments I have in my previous video about a lot of persons saying that Royal Q board is a scam, it doesn't work, we should show the result from the Binance app and not from the Royal Q app and so on the whole lot of you who have different views to this and the problem is because you don't understand how this app work or how the trading board works and you just expect that once you put in a hundred dollar when you come the next day it should turn to five hundred or a thousand dollars it doesn't work that way and that is the essence of me making this video so if you are new to my channel if this is the first time of seeing my video and you like videos about crypto trading and investing about making money online then consider subscribing hit the notification bell to be the first to be notified each time videos like this are published on this channel and give this video a like uh, you can equally join my telegram group i actually send signals you can equally go to my website to subscribe to my daily signals um, for futures and spot and uh, not spot trading just for futures trading alone that is what i send that signals for so you can come in here to the website and subscribe if you want to trade futures and make money faster and so on or join the telegram group using the link in the video description with that said now on the royal keyboard with some of the comments i got was people saying we should show the result on binance and if i go to my binance app here here on the binance app what i do I trade futures myself and I send that signals for futures trading um, for those who subscribe to the premium pack and I use the bot to automate my spot trading and because of some of the comment I got I just carried out this experiment to actually show you how this or to prove you wrong that the Royal keyboard is not a scam so here on the Binance app if I go to the trade tab and I go to history here on the history, if I create on, I click on trade history up here. These are the trade history of that is carried out on my app, on my Binance app. You can see that I, I, of recent I've been trading Solana, so you can see that there is a buy. There is a buy of Solana here. There is a sell here. There is a buy. And so on so if I keep scrolling down here you see that there are buys and there are sales this simply means that this board is actually working so if you scroll down here you continue to see buys and sales of different pairs that I'm currently trading and so on it means that it is actually working now why I cannot show you balance and tell you that okay I started with a hundred dollar now I'm at five hundred dollar it doesn't make sense because on the spot trading on Binance it doesn't tell you how much you made in trading even if you are doing this manual manually it doesn't tell you that this is the fee it is only on features that you will see profit and your losses and the rest on the trade history so if i go ahead and show you my balance that okay i started with a hundred dollar and now i'm at five hundred dollar it does not make any sense because i can just deposit five hundred dollars to my account and tell you that this is what i've made but truly sincerely this board has been trading and the problem a lot of persons have been having is based on the configuration on the Royal Q app. And let me explain that. If I click, I'm trading currently trading big USDT. So if I go ahead and click on this, please pay attention to this. When I go ahead, you can see that position amount here is about $30.67. That is the position amount. Now, the average price, the last price that this um, um, uh, bought traded this coin or bought the last time he bought this coin the coin was at $3.19 which is this average price that is the last action that this bot took on this particular pair it was at $3.19 with that said if I come back here right now on the big USDT you will see that the floating losses or the floating loss here is around $10 here where it says floating loss you see that is around ten dollars and the current price right now is around two dollar thirteen cent two dollar thirteen cent that is the current price of big right now and that is why you are seeing right here that it is minus 33 percent since the last action that this bot took 
now the reason for this is because i didn't have enough money for this board to continue to buy now if i go with the default setting of the margin call limit which is seven times it means that i need to have two thousand five hundred not anything not less than two thousand five hundred and forty dollars in my account because that default setting has been configured for the board to continue to buy each time the crypto market dips up to 47.2 percent it means that if the market drops from wherever we are right now let's say from that three dollar which we saw here from this three dollar 19 cent which we saw here if it start dropping right now it has dropped by 33 percent or thereabout so the board has been configured the default configuration is that when it drops up to 47.2 percent it will continue to buy with that said using that default setting it means that if it continues to buy it will continue to sell because when it drops it increases that's how the crypto market works when it drops it increases when it drops it increases so if you continue to drop and you have set your take profit to one percent or two percent or thereabout whenever it increases from that last drop to one by one point two percent it will sell the last action it took but right now i don't have enough funds in my account since the uh, the this uh, particular token was at three dollars and that is why you are seeing this percentage this minus 33 percent the 33.2 percent right here and then the floating loss is around ten dollars floating loss doesn't mean that you have completely lose the money this is actually telling you that if you manually sell this coin if i come in here and i click on sell right here i can manually sell this and i can manually buy if i come here and click on sell it means that if i take that action i will be losing ten dollars but the floating loss is there to tell you that this percentage that has dropped so much if you sell this you will be losing ten dollars or thereabout the same things apply to all of these coins that you see here i don't have funds for this coin to keep on buying and buying and buying and i did this on the purpose to actually show you those of you who are saying it is a scam and so on who want to make uh, you know the, the whole money out of this platform in a day it doesn't work that way and if you don't understand what dca means dollar cost averaging that is what exactly this app uses in trading um spot trading for you so whenever a crypto market or the crypto price drops to a certain level the board buys and wait for it to increase based on the settings that you made and wait for it to increase so what i want to tell you in this video is if you really want to know whether this board works or not go and deposit two thousand five hundred and forty dollars or two thousand six hundred dollars to your board to your royal Q board and go ahead and trade only one currency only one pair that is what you are going to trade only one pair with the default ten dollar by buy, um, buy limit go and use ten dollars only increase it to fifty dollars don't increase it to a thousand dollars or thereabout but deposit two thousand six hundred dollars to your account and trade only one pair and the pair i want to recommend is you can either trade um just go with this compound coin usdt this comp usdt this is the coin you are going to trade and then give me a feedback after one week if you have made profit if the 2500 or 2600 will increase or not another thing you should note is that if i pull up my calculator here let me go ahead and pull up my calculator here is that if you are trading with ten dollars per trade ten dollars it means that if and then you've set you you are using the default setting of taking profit at 1.3 it means that you are going to make 1.3 percent of ten dollars so if i go ahead and do this calculation by saying ten dollars times 1.3 divided by 100 it means for every trade that is carried out you are making 13 cents that is what you are making in a day now with the strategy that i'm showing you to have up to 2600 in your account and then use the default ten dollars to trade let's say in a day you carry that 10 trade so this 13 cent you are making per trade will be times 10 so times 10 will give you a dollar three cent if you carry that this by 20 times in a day depending on the market this is what you are going to make and then if this trade is carried out by 100 times or thereabout you are going to make 18 dollars it all this is just a simple strategy that we use on this board 
you cannot make money with the royal keyboard trading with just a hundred dollar you can't make money you'll be making some percentage some cent like 13 cent 12 cent now in the 13 cent you are making remember that binance equally charges fee every trade that you carry out on the binance or the hobby platform there is a fee that is charged out of it so at the end of the day you may be left with six cent depending on the fee that they are charging you so don't just conclude because you want to turn or you want to double your hundred dollar using the bot you cannot do it even if you are manually trading spot there is no way you can manual you can double your hundred dollar trading spot if you want to make money faster trade features but remember that features come with a lot of risks in as much as you you know it's possible to make money faster it is equally very possible to lose money faster trading features and that is why i'm giving you the opportunity now for those of you who want to actually um, take um, advantage of this you can come in here to the website um, to digitallearner.com and actually subscribe to the premium package if you want to this is optional it is not a do or die affair thing but if you want to rely on this board and make profit then please you need to have a decent amount of money with the board so if you are having anything less than a thousand anything from a thousand dollars and then below just trade only one pay and if you want to increase your settings to a hundred dollar per trade then you need to have enough fund in your account to be able to trade anything from five thousand dollars and above you should be able to trade this money is totally yours the board does not have access to the money all you do is on your binance account they just buy and sells for you and at the end of the day if you want the money back you can sell it and withdraw it to your bank account nobody is going away with that money so i just want to let you know that if this board must work for you you need enough fun in the board to be able to make profit all right so that is it for this video and in my next video i will actually be demonstrating how to set up um, the settings for a larger amount let's say you have ten thousand dollars five thousand dollars with the royal keyboard and you want to start trading with it i'm going to do that settings in my next video so i'll see you in that video